This video will explain the, about the instrumentation. Instrumentation is classified into two MI instruments and MC instruments. MI instruments is a uh, moving iron instrument. It is used only AC and DC. Uh, moving coil instruments is uh, only used of uh, um, DC. A moving coil uh, indicated uh, this symbol. Moving iron instruments uh, indicate the sine wave uh, symbol. This is a ammeter. Ammeter used for the measure of the current. Uh, it is always connected to series the circuit. Uh, this instrument's a low resistance ammeter. It is used only uh, DC supply. Uh, this DC supply indicates the is uh, underlying. This is the common point. Uh, this is the variable point. This is uh, 50 ampere, then uh, 25 ampere. Uh, the, this point is uh, adjust the um, dial. This is the voltmeter, which is used for uh, measure the uh, supply voltage. This always connected to uh, across the load. Uh, it have a two point. Um, one is the positive and negative. Uh, it is used only DC supply. It's indicated here. Okay, what this thing denotes? Uh, this is used uh, to adjust the dial. Uh, uh, because uh, zero. This is the watt meter, it is used for measure uh, power of the all circuit. Uh, it have a two coil, current coil and pressure coil. Current coil always connected to series the um, circuit and the pressure coil connected to um, parallel to the connection. It have a four terminal M, L, C, V. M is uh, indicated to main, L indicated to uh, line, uh, C indicated to common, V indicated to voltage uh, current coil indicated the cc pressure coil indicated the pc current coil have a low turns and thick wire uh, pressure coil have a um, large number of um, turns and a, um, high resistance and a thin wire this is uh, instrument is called uh, rheostat uh, also called uh, variable resistance they have a two common point uh, uh, one is the this, uh, another is uh, this. Uh, where start from here and then from here is the variable point. Uh, whenever the variable res uh, use uh, resistance used, uh, one point they take here, then variable point take here. One terminal is connected here, another terminal is connected uh, here. This current passing uh, through this coil, then uh, receive, uh, uh, receive here then pass through this uh, point is the variable point whenever I uh, varying this point current pass through the coil then uh, passing this uh, then you receive get the output from there right? output from there and this uh, adjust the point okay this is the auto transformer auto transformer have a single winding this is the variable point, zero point, it's maximum point, zero to 260. Uh, it have a four terminal, red indicate the phase, uh, black indicate the uh, neutral. The another uh, same point is uh, black, uh, red indicate the um, phase and uh, black indicate the neutral. This is the input point and the output point. Whenever I change the voltage, uh, input is uh, 240 volt and output adjust uh, here also get uh, from corresponding the voltage okay so by varying this we can obtain different voltage at the output actually output. what will be the maximum voltage we can obtain from uh, this? 260 voltage maximum voltage maximum zero to can, 260, 260 what is the main use of this particular thing just of, uh, varying the voltage whenever uh, industrial application have uh, different types of voltage that okay. time uh, adjust the uh, whenever we want to 40 voltage that time adjust the okay 40 volt, 40 volt then get uh, of voltage output. we will get the required output again okay. irrespective of the input we can change the output, output that voltage. is a useful okay thank you this is a transformer which is a stationary device no rotating part it has it is three phase transformer uh, transformer is classified into two types a step up transformer and step down transformer uh, then classified into port transformer and uh, distribution transformer uh, um, this is a three phase transformer which have a four terminal uh, R, Y, B and neutral point which is connected into 120 degree displacement each coil neutral uh, tap uh, from uh, the center point of the star point. This is the power transformer, power transformer have a 
so many uh, commands uh, this is the fins fins used for the cooling purpose number of fins are arranged in parallel this is the main tank this main tank contains uh, both uh, winding primary winding and secondary winding primary uh, winding is going to do uh, incoming supply and uh, secondary winding is connected to the uh, load uh, this the main tank contains the uh, oil and uh, oil uh, class where um, oil cooling that for that above 7 point kilowatt ah uh, that above, above 7 point kilowatt uh, all transformer used uh, oil cooling oil, method. oil cooling method uh, oils have uh, two types uh, uh, named uh, one is ascaril and pyro coal uh, it is not used uh, um, vegetable it is used uh, only mineral oil not used uh, vegetable oil uh, it is uh, explosion vent explosion vent used to protection wall whenever a uh, temperature raise the uh, oil that time they uh, explode um, that the diaphragm point then the oh. cocktail uh, cocktail used uh, um, filling the oil okay uh, this is the uh, co uh, cocktail this is the filling the oil and remove the it is used the, uh, for uh, filling the oil and remove the oil this is uh, the temperature gauge uh, how is the oil temperature we can see then the um, breather breather is uh, connected to the conservator tank conservator tank the breather uh, pure condition with bluish color then after the absorbing the um, moisture, uh, it turns to white color. Uh, it is used with material silica gel. Buckles relay is uh, used to protecting relay. They have a two points. Yeah, about point is called A point and B point. A point is uh, used to the small uh, short circuit, and uh, below the B point is used to uh, high fault. Then uh, buckles relay placed in between the conservator tank and main tank. This is the phase sequence name U, V, W, and neutral. They have a two, uh, four point uh, connected to the earthing. Hello. Mm -hmm.